What you're about to see is a video that was unplanned. Well, unplanned. Well, I didn't plan about this because, um, <coughs> um, hold up. Let me still think. Because, actually, I was thinking about something else. Guys, there was nothing, so I decided to do this. Review some magazines, or whatever the books they call. Well, mostly flyers, magazines. Well, here they are. I know, I know you guys are thinking, hey, I thought you were talking about National Geographic, Time Magazine. Oh, I have National Geographic, but, huh, I don't, I didn't feel like doing it right now. Maybe for the next time use. Right, so, well, yeah, I can use, it. well, some of these, you get these from the mail, get these from a stadium, like the Oakland Coliseum, get this, get, get this from a store, somebody gives them to you, or just find out a random in a thrift store, or wherever, wherever you want to go, or just find it. Now, if you don't, if you don't see the ones in the bottom, that means I got, I got these in this, I got these, like Z's, um, um, some of them have, um, addresses on them, and I'm covering the address, because I don't want people to know, because, I don't, everybody covers their address, so I'm gonna put a Sharpie pen to cover this pen, oops. Dang. And, yeah. Anyway, so, I'm going to arrange them in order. I'm going to tell you what I might review each in different parts. Okay. Some, I'll release them late. And then part one. Well, sorry about the Well, instead of me wasting time, let's just tell about what we're going to need to take a look today. For now. Part one will be the Oakland Athletics magazine or flyer I got. Whatever this is called. I got this in a... I mean, I went to the... A's game. Another one is this 2008 Ultimate Sports Guide. Oops. Ultimate Sports Guide, which, um, this is 2008. Sometimes you're going to be outdated. The Gamma Bowl, Bowl is now the, called the Craft Fight Hunger Bowl. And the Warriors logo has changed. Another thing to remind you. Ah, screw this. I'm not wasting my time. Again. Sorry. Next, third part is going to be Upfront. New York Times Upfront from Scholastic, which advertised. The news magazine for teens. Well, is this a teen version for Scholastic News? And then this tennis magazine. Get better. This one's the one with the cover with Johnny Ma McEnroe. When did you know that he's number one crowned? And the guy who always, and the guy who always gets pissed off, which is kind of funny and kind of make people angry at the same time. No offense. No offense, Johnny Mac. Sorry about that. And finally, this Crutchfield, Crutchfield thing that tells about all the products that they have right now. This one has mm -hmm, the screen stuff, like the GPS. Oh yeah, that this one has Bob Melvin. It says his name there. Raiders and 49ers. Scholastic has a guy and that's from Scotland because they're thinking because the people from Scotland, like the Scots. They want they want their country to be their independence from Scotland. All right, so let's take a look at the A's magazine I got in when the in April when the A's versus the Indians and they lost five to one. Has any of you went to the game before? Has any of you watched the game? I'm just wondering. King of the Diamonds. Good luck in 2012. Obviously, the Giants are having good luck, not us. Well, we are right now. You don't even know who's winning. Is any guys fan? No, uh, look, it's a kid. It's a kid A. Certified authentic. Six dollars credit for food and drinks. Free swag, food, special prizes, cheer cards, and more. And yeah, that's about it. Sorry, this is Bob Belvin. Yeah, too lazy to read that. And all the other stuff right here. Uh, I'm too lazy to read this too. It's from A's President Michael P. Crowley. Thank you, Mr. Crowley, for telling telling that to us. Uh, this is when them. This is all the players and all the coaches out there, but they're practicing in the hot Arizona sun. Whoo! Manny Ramirez. Uh, he was in the minor league for Sacramento 
AAA affiliate for the A's. However, the A's traded him because he wanted to be traded or something. I don't know. And so he's a free agent now. We'll get him. I would add that it involves Jamal Weeks on deck. Where they're going to versus next White Sox, Blue Jays, Tigers. Yeah, by the way, this is outdated. This is April and May. Mm, 95.7 the game. <coughs> and what the A's tell they're going to, what you're going to get. Uh, I have this, the um, Kurt Suzuki fat ed, and the Raleigh Fingers bobblehead. Can't wait for Scott Hadyberg one. So excited for that one. And it tells all the programs right here. I can't. I'm using my iPad Touch recording this. It's like something wrong. Just trying to clean this up. It's not working. It tells all the games. Seating. And right now, who's leading off is Josh Reddick or something. Hey, do you have, do you guys collect these? Whoever's watching right now, do you collect these? Because if you do, try to try to um, share these. With me. And it's 2011 review, like. They just remember their memories with three players and some broadcast and a broadcaster. And then there's Dallas Braden that they're trying to try to question is Dallas Braden, Kurt Suzuki, Jamal Weeks, and Glenn Glenn Kuiper. And here's a quiz, 1972 A's. I'm going to read it. Uh, this is a story and unforgettable moments of when Adam Rosales, what do you say? Um, Brandon McCarthy, he's like, he sees his teammates and something like, what would they do if they are different stuff? Like, example, let's say Kurt Suzuki will be a good manager. Like, he could be a manager. Or Cliff Pennington would be a pitcher. Or Bob Melvin can still play. He's still trying to suck up here. Answers for the first one. Some two quits. Yeah, all stuff. Bob. Something invite Bob Melvin. Look at the ads too, they're kind of funny. Fortunately, I'm moving this too fast. Yeah, Tommy Malone, Jared Parker, and Brad Peacock. Young pitchers. Wow. Uh, uh MLB Network ad. Ooh, you know, thirds. Uh if you recognize their faces, please comment. Man, this video is taking long now. Sorry about that. I was wasting my time. More stuff. More ads. More ads. Stanley. Another thing. Ooh, another ad from the Oakland A's. Oh, the kids. So, in here. In here, you have to play that spot different thing. Word search. Logic quiz. I don't get this game. See, what does this do? I don't get it. Oh yeah, I get it now. And a comic that involves Timmy and the time travel bat. I'm too lazy to show it right now. So I'll keep it still so you can read it. And just move it around. Zoom it. Oh, by the way, if I'm going too fast, just pause it. Yeah, he went back to time. And upside down is the answers. Nope. Oh, wait, never mind. He didn't even... I was going too fast. Anyway, so here it is. These are the answers for what you just saw. Right here. See those blue circles? That means that's a difference. I can't because his quality sucks. Using my app to How do you record from HD? Down 12. The players... I may not have time to show you all of them because I gotta. I won't have time to show you all of these because it can, it's gonna take me time. Well, if you want to know all the players, just go to Wikipedia. Go to ESPN or their website. Don't look here. You can just go to a website. <coughs> uh, by the way, their last names go from alphabetical order. Let me show you an example. What to use? They use Tommy Malone as an example. So usually it shows them a picture, like what they are, the number, 
jersey number, tell them what position are they, or, yeah, pictures say left-hander, right-hander, their picture, uh, sorry, and um, mostly and their age, their bats, their throw, their height, their weight, where they're born, and all the other stuff, all the other stuff that how they acquired or how they free agent, and it even tells them, like, signed and Swine through when? In only one year, that sucks. Well, they get to have you when he says it is for a long time. Or not the other players. Hold up. Okay. Okay. Yeah, coaches. Stuff, stuff, stuff. That's it. Part one finished. Got form. Oh my gosh, I got. Four more. Well, this is going to be part two. The ultimate sports guy. Wow, 11 minutes already? Dang, this is a long video I ever made.